psychologists to evaluate what's happening here. Can you help us out? So this uh, expert came and observed just for one day the, the children. And then he instructed the managers of each one of these camps. Feed the children shortly before they go to bed and give each one of them a big piece of bread so that they can cuddle, hold in their arms. And lo and behold, when they did that and they put a piece of bread in the hands of every one of these children, they slept like babies during this night and the night that followed and the night that followed. These little children has hungered so much that they were afraid that if they fall asleep, if they close their eyes, by the word of God and I see it on your faces some of you have been blessed to hear again the, God, the assurance of God that he loves you but days are going to come when you are going to have to go through very rough times of your life and you are going to wonder if God cares and still loves me would you please do me a favor cuddle the bread of life. Cut all those precious promises of God given you that He's never going to forsake you or leave you. Hold on the Word of God and hold on, on God's promises. Feed every day and even when you are full and you do not want to eat anymore, cuddle, take in your arms and in your heart these precious promises that are going to bring you through times when you're going to be so discouraged that you're going to ask, is God still loving me? At the end of this uh, sermon, I would like to invite you to take out of your bulletin the yellow... I don't know, unless someone would like to lead out in the closing song, I would like to invite you to, uh, to stand up for, uh, with me for our closing song 493, Fill My Cup. Like the woman at the well, I was seen.
Let's bow our heads for the benediction, please. Bread of heaven, thank you. Thank you for feeling the most important need of our human souls, the assurance of love and acceptance. And Lord Jesus, thank you so much that you began your ministry by hungering for us so that we'll never be missing the bread of life. And thank you so much that you ended your ministry by thirsting the water of this world so that we'll never thirst for the water of life. Bless us in our daily walk to never desert you, to never abandon you, to never walk over the manna that is falling from heaven but to humble ourselves, to stoop down, to pick it up, and to make the thirsting and the hunger of the soul completely satisfied. In the name and the sacrifice of our Lord Jesus Christ, we ask for this blessing. Amen. We ask you to remember the graduates, the Fellowship Hall as well, honoring them. Have a nice day, Sabbath to you.